हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल साइबेरियन टाइगर वर्सेस वर्सेज पैक विल एलोन साइबेरियन टाइगर बी एबल टू विदस्टैंड 15 टू 20 ग्रे ओल्ब्स वी नो दैट दिस साइबेरियन टाइगर इज कंसीडर्ड वन ऑफ द मोस्ट पावरफुल बिग कैट्स इन द वर्ल्ड बट will he be able to defeat the ferocious old pack with his strength or will he give up in front of them the eurasian wolf also known as the common wolf or the central russian forest wolf is a subspecies of the gray wolf that share its habitat with the siberian tiger So friends first of all i will compare between our two dreaded competitors size and weight the maximum weight of a male gray wolf are ranging between 65 to 81 kg A typical northern male may be about 6.6 feet long including the bushy half meter long tail and standing 2.4 feet tall at the shoulder. The average length for a male Siberian tiger is up to 10 feet 9 inches from head to tail. Siberian tigers can stand 3.5 feet tall at the shoulder and weigh up to 280 to 320 kg but the recent studies of wild siberian tiger reveal that they are way up to only 190 to 210 kg due to poaching deforestation and changing in climatic condition bite force A wolf's normal bite force is around 400 pounds per square inch, but the highest recorded bite force for grey wolves stands about 661 pounds per square inch. The adult male Siberian tiger can deliver 950 pounds per square inch of force in a single bite. Speed The wolves can reach speeds up to 65 km per hour during a chase. The Siberian tiger can also reach speed up to 65 km per hour, but it's quite controversial. Some sites claim that Siberian tiger can run as fast as 80 km per hour. Fight Now let's look at the fighting round. The wolves is considered one of the most deadliest pack hunters of the world. They have strong jaws, deep efficient lungs, strong heart and high stamina. They are excellent solo killers but become even deadlier and efficient in a pack. This is how they hunt for survival. because they are super smart as well they strategize and have methods to their brutality on the other hand the main weapon of siberian tiger is its large size and heavy weight and their physiology allows them to turn their front paws up meaning they can hit and swipe laterally like a boxer which wolves can't wolves do have claws but they are not the hooked sharp tearing claws that tigers have tigers are flexible agile and have very fast reflexes while dogs and wolves are a little slower and rely on stamina tigers are also considerably stronger than wolves but a wolf pack can have up to 15 member one on one a tiger is able to take down a wolf but if the wolf had a pack then it could go either way 
the old pack may be able to take down the tiger with enough bites or the tiger can easily target one wolf until they realize they can't beat it. More than physiological, I think is fully a psychological fight. I think the only possible way a pack of wolves could take down a large Siberian tiger is if the tiger run from them, which doesn't seem likely because when a prey runs away, only then the hunting instinct of the wolves wakes up. But if the tiger continues to fight with courage by standing in its place without fear, then perhaps the old pack will not get any chance. The sad thing is that there are lots of video footage of one lion versus hyena clan on the internet. But I haven't found any single good video footage of a tiger and a old pack. And whatever I got is real or a movie clip, really I don't know. Based on the clip I found, I can say that defeating a healthy adult male tiger will not be an easy task for a group of wolves. So in the end, my final answer is yes. In theory, it is possible only when the tiger is juvenile, young, sick, old, injured or female tigress. But the chances of winning will be extremely low when the packs fight a fully grown male Bengal or Siberian tiger. I think such a fight can go both ways, but I think the tiger wins most of the time. I don't think a wolf pack will usually dare to oppose a tiger. In Siberia, wolves tend to avoid areas where tigers are present. So in the end, I would say that a large pack of wolves could do it, but they often avoid being confronted with the large adult Siberian tiger. So at last, it is concluded that Siberian tiger has more than 55% chances of winning this fight against Old Pack. So friends, what's your opinion to tell me in the comments?